Hey there, welcome back. The last time we were going undercover for a soap plant to figure out what's happening with Top Talent. Ends up she, from the looks of it, is being extorted. And it looks like they're not letting her see her father in any way until they get the money. So we are going to break her father out today. So let's do it. I'm just gonna, oh. From wipes to can, canes, we got it all. Come to Love Magic for all your love adult weapon needs. <laughs> wipes and canes, huh? Sounds painful. Might be worth swinging by. Yeah. So remember the other day, or the other episode, whatever you want to call it, I was talking about Love Magic, the, uh, very adult store. Well, they're a weapon shop. Kind of. Alright. Ooh. I actually got some decent upgrades. Alright. I could buy three of these and increase my defense by quite a bit. And I could buy three of these also, okay. Yeah, I'm broke. I don't deserve the high class stuff. Alright, I can afford a few weapons. Oh yeah, that's actually a really good increase. 33. And 6. And 22. Alright, we have a small increase to our defense and a small increase to our DPS. First time buying actual gear. Alright, should be a taxi. Probably somewhere over here. And I don't think there's going to be any uh, side stories out this night. Alright, let's go. I want to be at... Oh yeah, uh, we'll do here. Alright, I forgot I can just call taxi with my phone. Right, right, right. Keep forgetting these things. Also, you have to forgive me. Just woke up. Mm. Felt like playing a little more before I hit the gym today. Come on. How odd. The loading times are extremely bad lately. <sighs> I don't know why. Also gotta do more play exploring out here and find all the silver chests. Then there's that arch. Alright, we're here. 
survive bar. Jazz and karaoke. This the place you're a regular at? Yep. It's just you. <laughs> yeah, such great customer service, huh? No wonder this place is always empty. This place? I only run it for fun. Kind of prefer it empty, in fact. <laughs> Bullshit. Hey there, Dachi-san. Hey, Iroha-chan. Who are your friends? Some guests of mine. Kasuga and Namba. Hey. You never bring anyone with you. In fact, is this a first? Uh, I guess it is, now that you mention it. That must mean you actually like them, huh? <laughs> Hell no. You wouldn't catch me hanging with these knuckleheads unless I had to. <laughs> you're so cute when you're embarrassed. Uh, <laughs> give me a break. Anyway, listen. I've got a request. Hang on. Let me guess. You want me to add their drinks on your tab. <laughs> oh, you know me so well. Uh, you mind, though? I promise I'll make them come back as paying customers. Oh, good grief. You really an ex-cop? <sighs> you win this time. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right, let's get to drinking. Bar Survive has become the new hangout spot for Kasuga and his party. Hey, what's up with Namba? We barely get started and he passes out? He's probably just tired. Can't blame him after everything we did today. Well, tomorrow's only gonna be worse. But you know, for some reason... Being around you makes it feel like it'll work itself out. Oh yeah? You must be pretty wasted if you're handing out compliments. But I'll take it. <laughs> I'm barely even feeling a buzz. Oh, he's drunk all right. Drunk on the rush of a hot and steamy friendship. <laughs> Iroha-chan. That was two feet over the line and you know it. Don't poke an old bear, huh? Dachi's son likes us. Huh. That feels kinda nice. Oh. While strolling around, you can collect CDs, to which you can listen to it, to arrive. I can keep going if you can. Listen. That's you. Your tab doesn't look exact exactly look like it can keep going. Come on, don't be a narc. Should I throw some back with a dachi? Drink links. Basically friendship links from persona. Dining and fighting alongside your companions will fill your bond gauge with them. Once it's full enough, talk to that set to said companion and survive the trigger trigger their special side stories called drink links drink links listening to your companions troubles and lending them a help helping hand can greatly strengthen your bond with them as your relationship grows and your bond level increases so does the number of jobs and skills available to your companion this in turn will improve their abilities and give you a huge advantage in battle take some time to get to know your companions build those bond gauges and see what surprises each drink link has in store Yo, Adachi-san. What's that you're drinking? 
<laughs> hey, keep it down, will ya? Why? Oh, is that convenience store sake? Shh, you don't have to announce it to everyone and their mother. You brought your own drink to a bar? <laughs> Hell yeah! It cost an arm and a leg to get a good buzz going here. That's why I got this little lovely at a store down the street. <laughs> you ought to do the same. Show your wallet some tender love and care. Hmm. Let me see. I'd rather make my own. Yeah, but I'd be upfront about it. A good drink's worth a little debt. Hmm. Let it go. Nah, I just order a drink from the bar. Even if it meant going into debt. You'd go into debt just for a drink? Hey, it's not just a drink. It's an experience. It's a chance to indulge and just let it all out, you know? Hell, you never know when a drink might change your life. It might lead you to your soulmate. And I say, the guy behind the bar who's helping provide the space for that, that guy deserves some fat stacks. Well, you sure are a nice guy, Kasuga. Well, maybe I should take your advice. Actually, no. If I go into debt, I won't pass my background check. <laughs> hey, here's a solution. I'll buy you a drink. Hey, thanks. Kindness of 20. Speaking of money, what they did to you was fucked up, man. Discharge right before your retirement? Ah, it ain't so bad. At least I get to know I was canned for sticking it to fucking Horonouchi. My opinion? That's better than just staying on the force and turning a blind eye. Let me see if I remember this correctly. You and Hori no Uchi first crossed paths during a case 20 years ago. Yeah, it was a nasty one. Robbery and double homicide of some sweet old couple. My team found a suspect and made an arrest. Man by the name of Kasumi. He had a mile-long rap sheet, burglaries and shit. Plus, he had no alibi for the time of the murder. But in the end, he was innocent. Yeah. I finally figured that out from his son. His son? Kasumi had a wife and kid. Kid was five years old at the time. His name was Takashi. The little guy told us he'd been on a walk with his dad at the time the homicides were committed. Of course, there's always a chance that the relatives will lie in hope of saving their family. So HQ was prepared to ignore Takashi's testimony. And I was too at first. But the more time that passed, my thoughts kept coming back around to what the little boy said. And even after Kusumi was arrested, I kept looking into it. I finally found the owner of a cigarette shop, who told me he saw Kasumi walking with Takashi at the time of the crime. Takashi's testimony was legit all along. I contacted HQ right away and requested Kasumi's release. But Horo no Uchi made sure it never happened. And he was able to do that because he was top dog at the Kanagawa police back then, right? Yeah. And don't forget, he'd just been offered a job with the Tokyo police, so... He was desperate to cover up any recent blunders like a wrongful arrest. He shipped poor Kasumi off to prison, knowing full well the man was innocent. Next thing I know... Kasumi's killed himself in his cell. So Horinouchi was willing to sacrifice people's lives just to advance his own career. Yeah, I'm starting to understand why you got so much beef with him. Uh, I got beef with myself, too. I'm partly responsible for what happened. If only I'd believed Takashi's testimony from the start, the arrest wouldn't have happened in the first place. You don't know that for sure. No one else believed the testimony either. Yeah, but I'm the one who interviewed the kid. Let me tell you. Even after all this time, I still can't forget his face. Man, but couldn't you have just leaked the fact the charges were false? You know, to the news? I gotta assume that'd be your way of atoning for Takashi-kun, right? <laughs> well, you're not as dumb as you look, Kasuga. That's exactly what I thought at the time. But I screwed it up. Didn't choose the right people to leak to, so... I got swept off to the license center faster than the leak got swept under the rug. Worst fuck up of my life. Don't be so hard on yourself, Adachi san. Sorry. Really killed the mood, didn't I? <laughs> it's okay. A true friend doesn't care how many moods you kill. 
You know, for an ex-Yakuza, you can say some cheesy shit. But it's sweet. What do you mean by that? Yakuza's all about brotherhood. Well, all I know is if I'd had a brother like you on the force with me, my life might have turned out different. Ah, but if the cops were anything like me, this whole country would be fucked sideways by now. <laughs> Can't argue with that. <laughs> you weren't supposed to agree with that. <laughs> anyway, let's have another drink. On you, if you don't mind. Fine. Hey, bartender, can we get another round? Hmm. Kazuko's feel feels his bond with Danchi grows stronger. Danchi will now gain more experience when he is not in the active party. Nice. Well, about that time, I guess. Ah, leaving already? Sorry, Iroha-chan. We got a big day tomorrow. Yo, Namba. You gonna crash on the bar or you wanna head back? <laughs> I like the vibe of this place, though. Me coming back is another thing you can count on. Sure. Make yourself at home. <laughs> Nobody else does. And listen. Take care of him. Sorry? Let's just say he's not usually a happy drunk. I guess that means he has a soft spot for you guys. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, I know the guy. He's a good for nothing, but he's good at heart, too. So keep your friends close, you hear? I can do that. Hey, Kasuga, what's the holdup? Let's go. Oh, sorry. Well, see you later. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Nice bar. All right. But let's roll. Let's head to the Sunlight Castle. <laughs> During certain restaurant, uh, dining at certain restaurants in Yokohama with your friends and ordering certain combinations of the menu will allow you to see what's called table talk unfold. The bond between you and the participating party members will deepen, so be sure to try everything on the menu when you walk into a new restaurant with them. Okay. Interacting with a party member will fill your bond gauge with them. Fill up a certain amount and you'll trigger drink link. Learning about party members' secrets, pasts, or grievances with, will further, further deepen your bonds with them. Strong bonds can give you excellent status boosts in battle, so it never hurts to be a friend. Okay. Let's see. Are there any... Side quest doesn't look like it. Are away actually alive? There's one up here. We'll hop on that one real quick. I'm gonna, you know, do these as they show up because some of them are really, really good. Time to fight the homeless. Yeah. Have fun with this. Watch this! Let's go! I'm up! There we go. Goodbye. Oh, I got wood. Alright, let me... Okay. Yeah, let me activate the taxi. Alright, so I'm just gonna run there. I don't think I can do the thing down there yet, so I'm gonna avoid it. And I won't be able to do that until I think chapter 5 or 6. Oh, wait, there's a bug on the tree. Alright, I gotcha! The last time I caught a bug was back when I was a kid. Never know when you might need a bug on your side. Now keep it. Fuji Mon, that is. Fuji Mon, that is. Fuji Mon, that is. Fuji 
Demolition. Yeah. Those two are good. Yeah. You wanna go? I'm up! Yeah. The enemy is defeated. Yep, just got both of them. So bitchy. Oh wait. Should I open it? It's a silver save, should I open it? Yes. Sweet! I got a binding. Uh, I'll take. Binding is basically, if I remember correctly, is a silver. No, a bronze bangle from a Final Fantasy type game. Because it increase, yeah, increases your HP by 20. Here, I have a binding number. Side stories to the left. Oh. Oh. Uh. Oh. You'll never get stronger with a stance like that. I'll show you how it's done. Hold out the board and get ready. Practicing karate, huh? Didn't I need wood for something? Ah. Oh, yeah. Jinai asked me to get some wood for that bookshelf he's building. Maybe I'll let me, they'll let me have some with these Sup? boards. Hey, you think I can have a few of these boards? I'm trying to build a bookshelf. Well, we're using these for our training, actually. If you feel you can provide an adequate substitute, that will be agreeable. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll make a better opponent than those boards. Good to hear. Just know we won't be holding back. Let the battle begin. Cool. Come All right, on let's do this. Take me. Oh, I was too okay. late on that. This. Damn it. Let's go. Get serious. Let's go. Damn it, they all moved out of the way. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Kinda like kicks the crowd oh, yeah. kids, but you're weak. Okay. Uh, I'm up. Uh, nice some levels. Hell yeah. Ooh, push and shove. Look at me go. And some stats. Nice. <laughs> Just like that. What do you think? Uh. I think we lost to an amateur. Oh, no, we're getting back to basics first. We're gonna run. Going on a run. Get Sensei. Yo. Wait. I can have some of these boards, right? Take how many you want. Okay. I forgot you need to get the boards from somewhere else. I thought you just had to get them somehow. All right, got the wood. Now to find some nails. I already got the nails. I got nails in my inventory. Oh, let me go on here for the nails. Man, you're making me go to a lot of places right now. Actually, no. I want to go here and then there. So I, I love how in regular Yakuza games, I'm not going to say zero though, because zero, they're having a flood of money and wealth, and the money literally sprays out people like confetti. And every other Yakuza game, you're getting like more than a lot of money. You're getting a lot of money per battle. In this game though, I'm still flat bloody broke. <laughs> 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 what are you doing? 
What do you want from me? <laughs> Man, we just need a teeny tiny bit of money for our allowance. Oh, hey, nails. Used nails. Gen Genai's ass. We need to get him some nails. Those will work. The hell? What are you looking at, old man? You got something to say? No. Nah, I got nothing. Just thought, I, uh, just thought I'd see if I can take some of those nails off your hands. Uh huh? Huh? What the fuck are you talking about? Come on, guys. Let's kill this clown. Man, everyone in this town oh, needs to be killed in this going fast. down. Cool. Check this out. Right. Shot. Shot. Really? Too late again? What am I doing right now? Yeah. You're in it now. Have fun with this. Let's go. Let's go. He's not resisting. No mercy. Let's go. Get away. What's okay. this? Damn it. Nice. My timing is awful today. Do something about this. Goodbye. Moving yeah. up in the world. All right, we got the nail. Yeah. Hey. So, want to try that again? No, thanks. We had enough. We're sorry. Thank you very much for saving me like that. How could I ever repay you? Don't worry about it. This is all I need. Alright, got the nails. I hate to say it, I have more than enough nails in my inventory. Okay, got the wood, got the nails. Time to meet Jinai, Dan, south of the Sakura River stream. <laughs> Alright, where's he at? There. Oh, good. I have a taxi ready for there, too. Oh, I just want can quest. Man, I should actually do can quest once and see how much money I can get. I will do that after I finish this quest. Why not? Hey. Here. The wooden nails you asked for. You're gonna have to pull the nails out, though. Well, what do you mean, pull them out? Huh? You got wood nails just like that? Well, you said you didn't have any money, so... <laughs> <laughs> I see, so that's what it means to put through into something. Hmm? Hmm? Oh, nothing. You just really thought outside the box is all. Eh, it's no big deal anyway. Anyways, let's build that bookshelf. Hey, kitty. <laughs> Hold on! Don't put so much force into it. Uh oh. The board split. No sweat. There's plenty of them. Hi, kitty. Oh, that's actually decent. Yeah, that's actually nice. It's done. I'd say we got ourselves a bookshelf. Well, that hard part's done. Now all I have to do is give it to him. <sighs> you really think he'd be happy with a bookshelf made by an old bum like me? You might as well just throw it out at the end. Look, you come this far. Why get cold feet now? Worrying's not gonna change anything. There he is. Oh. Shotokun. Mister, are you okay? Oh. Who are you? Yeah. My name's Kazuga. Don't worry about me. The old man's got something to tell you. Huh? Huh? Me? Hmm. I heard it was your birthday, so I built a bookshelf for you. you told me you like books, remember? I really hope you like it. Thank you. 
remember that I like to read. <laughs> this is incredible. I'll cherish it forever. <laughs> really? Well, if you're happy, I'd say it was worth the effort. Tsukasan, thank you for helping me out. I just wish I had a way to pay you back. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to do that. In fact, I'm, I'm in a pretty good mood. So why don't we go grab some grub? Oh, uh, but... You sure about that? Yeah. Yeah. Of course. Let's see. How's... Uh... Sek Sekiai Road sound? <sighs> Sounds good to me. I'll go get ready. Why don't you go ahead? Yeah, sure thing. Uh-oh. That quest isn't over either. Mushimushi! No, I'm gonna do a round of can quest. Yo, Shinri. I'm gonna click I'm gonna use easy because I never got an S rank on it. Yeah, let's collect some cans. This guy wants a little money, a little cash. Time for a can quest. I'm going this way first. Time to get paid. the mark. Yes. What a haul! Woohoo! There we go. <laughs> you racked up a ton, I guess. You really went all out. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, uh, saw the shot. You can turn in the end, which really isn't worth it, or you can get a bunch of other things too. There's basic equipment, a vintage guitar, but we haven't gotten there yet. Uh, trash, worn TV, microwave, a lot of insects. These are great. Ooh, Persona 5. Ooh, wait. Token beneath the mask. Ooh, nice. Ooh. Some of those songs are actually really good. Alright, I just want to do Can Quest once. I'll do more of it at my own time. Later. Uh, okay. Oh, wait. Right, we're meeting him there. Hmm? Oh, 
それでは。This is the bookshelf we gave Sholo Kun. Oh, sorry to keep you waiting, Kazuka san. Mm, that's. Oh. 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 This is the bookshelf we made. <laughs> oh, I had a feeling this might happen. I'm just a little bum after all. Yo. Enough of that, alright? It's not like you gave him a crap gift. Yeah. Bookshelf's not the problem here. Us homeless folk aren't exactly accepted by the rest of society. To them, we're just smelly, dirty, good for nothings, capable of lashing out or doing something crazy at a moment's notice. Hey, that's not. Mm -hmm. Bookshelf, someone like me, belongs in the trash. Sorry, kazuka -san. I think I lost my appetite. We'll eat together some other time. Uh. <sighs> the nice sound seemed pretty down. Should probably go check on them. Mm. Alright. <laughs> Denai san seemed pretty beat up about that bookshelf. Hope he's alright. Hey, there he is. Sup? Hey, buddy. Cheer up. I know it's hard and all. Uh. Oh, Kazuka san. Uh. Mister. Shodokun. Oh no! Hey! You with the fro! Give me back my shell! Huh? Huh? Give it back? Didn't you throw it away? Well, actually, it wasn't me. It was my. Mate! Shodo! What are you doing? Dad? What's gotten into you running at the house like that? To think. You'd come all the way, all this way, just for this hunk of junk. It's not junk, it's my bookshelf. Sorry about that. That was a little something I gave Shoto I knew it. I thought I saw Shoto talking to some bum. Well, he's not gonna accept charity from some washed up burnouts like you. Now let's go, Shoda. You and me are gonna have a serious talk when we get home. Okay. Oh no! Wait, this is my fault. Paul, please don't blame Shodoku. Call it. Get it. You have no right to tell me how to raise my kid. You stay away from my son, you hear me? Hey. Hey, give this guy a break. He just thought it'd be nice too. And who are you? One of the bums, grimy little friends. I swear you're like cockroaches. Just hear me out. We just wanted to make Shoda happy. Damn it. As if I believe you. You're probably just hoping my son a scam. Not like that at all. Don't bother trying to explain. I didn't want to resort to violence, but this is to protect Shoda. I'll make sure you and your friend never come near my son again. <sighs> hey, we're actually past talking already. Have it your way then. Not a loser. Yeah. All right. I'll just set you on fire. Here you go, Kado. 
What's this all about? What's huh? this all about? Huh? I just want to protect Shota. You mellowed out yet? That old man gave the kid that bookshelf because he knew it was his birthday. He was just trying to do something nice for him. His... his birthday? You mean you forgot your own kid's birthday? And you were trying to blame the old man? <laughs> no, it's not that! Dad's been working really hard ever since Mom passed away. I can't blame him for forgetting. No. No matter the reason, a parent who forgets their child's birthday has failed at being a parent. Uh, Dad... Since the day we said goodbye to your mother, I've done everything I can to make sure I could provide for you. It was all for you. But... Maybe that was a mistake. You know, I get the feeling we're pretty similar, you and I. Huh? I also had a family before I ended up out on the street. I had a son just like Shotokun, as a matter of fact. I grew up in a poor household as a kid. So I worked from morning till night to make sure my kids wouldn't have to go through the same thing. Never once thought of how it might affect them. In the end, my family gave up on me. And here I am. I'd lost sight of what was really important. Failure's a natural part of life. But some failures you can take back, and some you can't. And that's where we differ, you see. I'd say you still have a chance, don't you think? A chance? Huh? Dad, are you sure about that bookshelf? Well, what's wrong? If I'm buying you books, you're gonna need a bookshelf, right? Now that I look at it, it's not a bad bookshelf. Dad! <laughs> Sacrifice stone. This is for your troubles. Please, take it. Sorry about earlier. I think I'll take that chance you mentioned. <laughs> Pick out some good books for him, all right? Of course. Thanks, you two. I'll treasure this bookshelf for the rest of my life. Ah, sounds good. Get along with your dad now. I will. See you later. I'm glad it all worked out. Yeah. And you said nobody would be happy with a present from someone like you. But you're dead wrong. Your gift wasn't dirty or grimy. You made that bookshelf of love. That's the best kind of present anyone could ever ask for. <laughs> Sacrifice don't do if it's what I think it is. It's a free revive basically Yeah, basically when knocked out your HP recovers but the stones broken afterwards. I'm saving you All right now it's time to probably do the story because everyone's probably like wow well, stop doing sub stories It's like I like doing sub stories. Oh, there's one all the way up. Oh wait is that the Mario Kart one? Nah, I'm not gonna worry about it right now. And someone right now, is, if anyone's watching this, is probably like Mario Kart. Yeah, <laughs> long story. Alright, we're 
here. Oh dear, we get in there before we get into the battle. Actually, I want to. Should I eat before I do this? Ah, uh, we'll just do it. Let me just do this. All right, let's do it. I'm gonna drink some water while this is all happening. This isn't break time. On to the next bathroom. You're even slower than yesterday. I'm going. I'm sorry. Are you okay? Hey, watch where you're going, janitor! Ooh, security card. Hello, Director. The woman's father. His name's Tatsuro Mokoda, correct? Understood. I'll carry it out immediately. Yes. Don't worry. Yes, he's out like a light. General anesthesia. Here we go. You know. Most people hope and pray that they'll die in their sleep. You're one of the lucky ones who actually gets to do it. Stop! Who are you? How did you get in here? Dakota. This is Nanoha's dad for sure. Sir, wake up. Let's get you out of here. Oh, reinforcements. Damn. I didn't waste any time. What are you doing here? Contractors aren't allowed. Explain yourselves now. Hey, calm down. Can't you recognize your own uniform? Give me a break. You're not one of us. No, we aren't. Because you're not nursing home guards. Not with that kind of weaponry. I bet you've got a lot of ink underneath those uniforms. Since you're from the Seiryu clan. Hmm. Huh. So, you did your homework. We know everything, man. Even what the Seiryu clan has been doing in this room. Well, good. That makes our decision easy. We'll have to kill you and the patient! All I know is the guards and save the old people. Okay. I got this. Okay. 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 That's not what I want to do it too, damn it. Yeah. We. Get alive. Check this out! There we go. Let's go. Grab her dad and get the hell out of here. Hey, what was that drug you were about to inject him with? It was potassium chloride. 
Holy fucking shit. I think that basically would induce a heart attack. Do you know what it does? They use it overseas for executions. The doctor was trying to kill her dad? Now that must have been how they killed the old woman. We got to him just in time. Guys, we ain't out of the woods yet. That's the guy from the cafe. Who is he? We're about to have our chance to ask him. He's coming this way. You all just made the biggest mistake of your lives. I hope you know that. Who are you? The director of this facility. And don't play dumb. I know what else you know about me. You mean how you're with the Seiryu clan? Yes. I'm Totsuka, from the Ryuto family. The Seiryu clan held its own against the Omi takeover. That made me think you guys must be pretty hardcore. And yet here you are, murdering old people for money. Where's the Yakuza's honor in you? The Seiryu clan is doing what must be done, for the good of society. You have no idea what burden we've taken on. Killing our elders for society's good? Go fuck yourself! You better let all the residents here go free right now, or I'll tell the whole world what you're really doing here! You're welcome to try, but that would require you to walk out of here alive. And killing you is no inconvenience to me. I've got enough chemicals to melt down all your bodies. Time of fury. Bring it on. All right. Okay. Watch Let's this. Go. Go around around. There we go, that's a good fire breath. Yeah, you wanna fight? Come on, get life! I'm up! You're in it now! You're weak! Coits the mundane is it? Ready for this? Don't get caught! Yeah! yeah. Have fun with this. Attack my Watch pigeons. This. Back on this. Oh wow, that's mm. actually really strong. Get serious. Let's go. Goodbye. You're in it now. Okay. I'm up! I feel the stats going up! <laughs> nah. Oh, bad breaker. Nice. God damn! Who the hell are you guys? Don't make me say it again! Let all the residents go! I'm afraid I just can't do that. Then we'll do it. We'll move them all out. Oh, shit. It won't open. I activated the emergency lockdown. That door won't open until this time tomorrow. What? You've lost. So stop fighting me. And maybe, just maybe, I won't call the police. I won't explain to them how our home for nice, well-to-do elderly people is being robbed by three thugs. What kind of Yakuza calls the cops? You're a stain on your family. 
Call me what you want. But if I call the cops, you're done. I suggest you give up and get out. Maybe instead, I'll rat you out. Oh, yeah? Uh, Ichiban? Rat him out to who? The Seiryu chairman. We just need to pay him a visit at their HQ. We'll go tomorrow, bright and early, and get the chairman to fix all of this. Don't you fucking dare! This is my business, not the chairman's! Hmm. Basically, like, run in the mall. word, I'll kill you! It's like a little kid so you're that scared of the chairman, huh? So? So, you're coming with me, you spineless worm. Huh? Yeah, you're gonna take me there yourself. Because if you refuse to come along... I'm gonna tell the big scary chairman everything you did. And maybe, some things you didn't, too. I mean, look at yourself. Doing business like this in the name of the Seiryu clan? As a Yakuza, you accept consequences for your actions. So... does this mean we have to go? Yes, yes it does. Here it is. There's their emblem. Wow. Wow, that's hell of a gate. Place, act, this place has the Yakuza HQ feeling down. Can't hurt to be cautious. Listen. Let's be sure we're ready to go. Got there. it. Okay. Hey, you wait right here, Tatsuko, Tatsuka. I told you what happened if you try to run, right? I know. I can't have you saying whatever you please the chairman after all. Could see there's anything. Uh, Watkins, medicine. All right. You know what? I'm feeling pretty good. I'm gonna save and hop right in Im immediately. Let's do this. Hey, you ready yet? Oh, yeah. Boy, looks like you're taking this seriously. I'll show okay. you in. Yeah. Show us in already. <laughs> this is only gonna go smoothly. Usually when the game tells you, don't make sure your weapons, armor, and items are in order before you enter this building, it's like, ah, uh, nothing's gonna I happen. I don't see any guards. That's because no one is stupid enough to try and raid the Serio clan. It's a trap. You set us up. We never grant entry to anyone from other factions. That gate drops like a cattle chute if someone walks through without giving the correct signal. Then, we take our time with the slaughter. Whatever their rank may be in their own herds, we don't give a shit. Where's the chairman? Upper floor somewhere? Perhaps. You'll never reach him. I won't let you get anywhere near his office. Oh, I was really hoping you'd seen the light. Guess we're back to using brute force, boys. I tell you, never a dull day with Ichiban. Old people better put us in their wills for this. Bring it! This bout being down. good. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, can I get multiple people with this? Get a lie. No. Okay. I got this. I'll just pitch right this. you. Have yeah. fun with this. Yeah. Don't get caught. Mm. Get serious. Check this Take out. The best shot. <laughs> Let's go. You're in it now. Wait. You're weak. Go in. <gasps> Yes. Those there? What? I got this. Hey. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Watch 
this. Don't get cocky. Cool. Kidding me? How are we supposed to get through? Well, standing around won't solve anything. Let's find another way around. So. Now the stone. Yeah, the electricity's cut off. Hmm? Hey, this door's open. Hey, gentlemen. Doesn't look like they want us through. Well, uh, doesn't look like they want us to blast through. Yeah, let's give them hell again. What? You guys, stupid. Let's just run. Technically, yeah, we could do that. Damn, the other door's locked. This is a dead end. This should hold it. Good call. Open up, assholes! Now what? We can't hold this forever! Then we need to improvise! Son of a... What the fuck? Where are they? I don't know where they went! The door's locked! And unlock the damn thing before they get away! Good, Namba. Coast is clear. Hmm. Now what? Listen. Should we try the... <laughs> Should we try the corridor that connects above us? Maybe we can get the chairman's room by going up the left side. Hmm. Maybe. Yeah, kind of roundabout. Four. Seems like the serial ma clan members blocked the door, unlocked the door for us too. Hold on. Hold up. Security might be tired that way. Let's see if we can enter from that door b uh, uh, over there first. Serious mushroom and impure lead. Not gonna ask why they have impure lead, but. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Gentlemen, get rid of him! Oh, they got tasers. Okay. Let's go! Who out of this? You wanna go? Thanks for walking into it, you make me happy. Cool, you wanna fight? Alright, boy, yeah! Come on now, take your best shot. You and the pole. Come up! Alright, I'm gonna do reckless charge on Aegis. You still. Thank you. I got this. Oh. You wanna fight? Yeah, it's one of those. Aegis! Yeah. Get 
Yes. You know what? No, he's almost dead. It's not worth it. Check this out. Okay, no more backup. Let's go. Come on. Here we go. Okay. That's better. Cool. I'm up! No one else is coming? Pretty weak ambush if you ask me. I bet those idiots wanted to hog the credit for taking out the intruders. Oh, is that what it is? Wouldn't it be easier for them if they all ganged up on us? Nobody climbs the corporate ladder in a group. Criminals included. Huh. No wonder I've never been promoted. Should I open it? Got it! And that's why in fighting games, they attack you one by one, because only one person gets to climb the ladder. Alright, this helmet is better for magic defense. Alright, once magic defense, I'll do it on Namba. Making sure I didn't get any new, new things. Oh, I got health ring. Uh, I have no idea what that does. Oh, raises attack by five. Give me a second. Alright. So we this is where we came from, so now we're gonna go here. Alright. Hey, I'm, I'm gonna look shape. Alright, first aid kit. Saving that for a rainy day. Should be healed now. Hell yeah! That's the one thing I like about this game is it's like a classic mm. RPG in a way where every time you get level, your MP and HP fully heal. It's nice. It's good, definitely a pinch. All right, got some toner. Happy Fento, emergency heal. Oh, hello. hello. I'll pound you into the floor myself! Not a loser! I'm gonna hold off, but I'm... Thinking. Okay. Actually, give me a second. You're in it now! Do I go? Yeah, let's do it. Gnarly Brock. Like this. Oh, yeah! Uh, ass huh, that reeks! Let's go! Let's go! Get serious. <laughs> Don't get cocky. Check this out. Oh, that's good damage. Yeah. yeah. Watch this. Damn it, not far. Cool. I'm up. 
Get making the first move and just see how it goes. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. Cool. I'm up. Okay. Don't get cocky. You're in it now. Namba, I want you to watch this. Merely decrease the dice. Oh, that reach. Yeah. Saving that and, Not bad. that, and we'll live now. Give me a. Uh, what do I want from this? A weapon. Should I open it? Sweet! Oh, actually, I think those are actually quite good. One second. Oh, yeah, it's great for healing, which uh, he's a healer, so give it to him. So, actually, that means I'm gonna actually equip. Do I want that on him? Increases defense. Nah. Alright. I came from that way. Okay. Anything else? No. Oh, I healed. There's a stupid. Oh, door's locked. Never mind. Oh, I have to. No, I. Which way are we going? <laughs> Behind us! You're never gonna make it to the chairman! <laughs> Holy shit! Hang on! Oh my. I'll get you out of this! <laughs> Hold on, Amba! I got gotcha. you! Wait, what about Adachi? Hurry. Just a little more! <laughs> Also, now we got lucky. That man used way too much for body strike. Oh fuck! Enjoy your flight. <laughs> Number over here. Adachi. Man, that guy used way too much for body strike. Don't. Give up! Oh, I'm <laughs> oh, he's not talking? Okay. That was a goner. You said it. Doesn't mean we have to climb back up. Seems like it. Let's look for another way. Alright, there's the health station I saw. Now I wish I didn't use the heals, but hey, live and let learn. Uh, 
Which I will abuse that. Caesar, bring it on. All right, let's be up in the Syria clan. Yeah. Pyro belch back up. Oh, everyone moved in the last second. Oh, I'm sad. Cool. Mega swing. You. Check this out. Get Caesar. Let's go. I got this. Okay. Have fun with this. Watch this. Yeah. I'm up. Okay, it looks like they're almost ready to rank up in the bonds, so yeah, that'll be something I'll do after this. Alright, that's not the way to go. We'll go in here. Oh, door's locked, never mind. Half empty drink. Ooh, my favorite. I've had enough of you rat bastards scurrying around. Time to get exterminated! Cool. Maybe I'll just exterminate you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, low yeah. late. My bad. Let's go. Now let's finish off the weakling. Get alive. Let's go. He has a crossbow and a knife. That's a combo. Okay. That's better. You want to go? I'm up. Get serious. Going in. No mercy. Yeah. Nope. I am not actually. I'm gonna take a power nap. Have fun with this. Oh yeah. Cool. Oh, Come on, let's go! this key to go mm. Wait, god damn it what key to go key go to maybe the iron door we saw on the corridor all right let's check it out we might find our way up what's this key to go oh god all right so that's an optional room let's head in there oh wait this way Okay, we got stuff in here. Mysterious stone. Should I open it? Yeah. Got it. Rusted chainmail. All right. How does that do? Oh. Really? Oh wait, I can put more clothes on you. But oh, it's one of these. Uh, blade resistance against all... Oh, defense plus 5? Ooh, okay. Defense 72, 57, 54. Alright, Namba, you're getting this.
Hey, well, guys, what's this key to go? God damn it. Like I said, my brain reads it way faster than my mouth says it. Ooh, good thing I came back. Ooh, that's actually be really good. Okay. And we go. Thank you. Alright, let's see if this key to go works. Oh, whoops, wrong button. Blueprints. Okay. Let's absorb blueprint for this facility. That's interesting. There's a ladder icon at the edge here. Yeah. Looks like it connects to, uh, with the room where we find the key to go, but I don't remember seeing a door. Maybe it's hidden. The building's a goddamn fortress, so the hidden passage wouldn't even survive. Yeah. That's gotta be it. Let's hurry back to that room and check it out. A hand grenade. Yeah. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Should I open it? Sweet! Alright, safety shoes. Maybe this time I'll actually equip it on me. Let's see. I get blunt resistance, but my elemental resistance goes down. Because they're steel toe boots. I get it. That's a really nice set of mm. armor. Mm. Outdoors. That's weird. Blueprint. Pointed right uh -oh. here. Whoa, check this out. What? Oh, that's obvious. You're right. How's it go? How's it go? Press it. Uh, sure. Here it goes. Seriously? Seriously? It worked. <laughs> Alright. Now we can go up. I just healed, so we're all good. I might want to save it. Oh wait, you can't save the dungeon. Never mind. Oh, I got some sturdy lumber. The sturdiest of all lumber. Or I can go down. Should I open it? Got it. A jacket. Man, we're getting a lot of gear today. A jacket? Holy cow, its defense is great. Um, you know what? I will have that myself. Oh. Yeah, okay. We're good. Stamina light will use one day, but not now. Also, okay, we're good. That was 100% worth it. I got really good upgrade for Ichi. Alright, let's actually go up a Once again, we have a save. And that, uh, okay. A toner. Should I open it? Yeah, Sweet! Okay, a health ring will increase the attack of the person who wears it, so I will equip it on you. Back again, huh? So this is where we are. Wait, we, we've been here already? Hmm. Doesn't seem too familiar to me. Oh, we were just here a minute ago. You guys have terrible memory. We actually were here a minute ago. This door should be open now, maybe. That's where the big guy threw us out. Is the big guy threw us out over here. That means boss time. If there's a safe spot. Hey, this place looks safe enough. Why don't we take a breather? It reminds me, yeah, this kind of reminds me of Persona 5 when you find the room. Do I have a, you know, item box? Oh, I do. Oh, right. They stuck all my items in the item box. Let me just pull all these out.
not go over there yet. Oh, yep, there it is. I will destroy everything. Alright, let's go. This seems like an important room. Hey man, we caught up with you. You're such a pain in the ass. We just want to see the chairman. Out of the way. <laughs> you made it this far. And that's far enough. Oh, I teach boss we fought along the way. <laughs> They're still standing after all that. <laughs> Long time no see. This time, be different. <laughs> The three of us together are unstoppable. <laughs> <laughs> then it's unstoppable trio against an unstoppable trio. Come on, Namba. Adachi-san. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You're going down. Alright. Okay. Let's see if I can line it up. Damn it, they move. Alright. Oh, he's on duty. You wanna fight? You know what? Let's just get some Gary Buster homies in here. Time to call a friend! I summon you! You want sudden death or sudden crisis? In service with a bounty. Thanks for calling out. Thank you, Gary Buster Holmes. I'm up. Let's go. Oh, I forgot a side effect. He has a chance of inflicting a stun. Well, that's gonna be great for me. Cool. Let's go. Get <laughs> No. Okay. Alright, let's go. The trio are down to a duo. I'm up. I got this. Going in. Damn it! I always do a bit late sometimes. Uh oh. Alright, Kyle goes. Now it's not under my control. Have fun with this. Now I'm pissed. Might as well lower his defense because he's gonna be attacking. Let's go. The hell's your fight? You're getting a heavy beat down. Did you gonna do anything? Black, he's being beat up in front of you. There we go. Okay. Watch this. Have fun with this. He looks so confident. I just beat up two of his people. Come on. Let's go. Now we're talking. Huh? 
Now, let's get it. Don't come on, get There we go. Moving up in the world. Yeah, how the likes of you learn to fight like that? Who are you? We're employees from your place of business, Otohime Land. Uh, you're from our own soap land? We were helping Nanoha Mukoda, a woman who works there. You've been sucking money out of her while keeping her dad prisoner in the old folks' home. I told you, we're doing what needs to be done. I've heard all that already, and it's bullshit! You can't just twist the Yakuza code to suit yourself! That's being a fucking prick! Stop this. Ooh. Ryui Ushino. <clears throat> Boss! Totsuka, what's happening here? Uh, there was a dispute on our turf. And so... You look like hitmen to me. Are you Yakuza? We're not hitmen. We came with a request for the chairman. A request? About Totska's business operation. Sunlight Castle? Could we have a bit of your time? How can I be sure you won't try to kill me? Frisk us if you want. We're unarmed. Hmm? Uh, what's wrong? This guy had a strange-looking bill on him. I've had that for a while. No idea where it came from, though. Someone just put it in my pocket at some point. <sighs> what should we do? Nothing. It's just play money. You sure you don't want to tie a string around it? Hurts like a bitch if you don't. I suppose you would know, wouldn't you? Of course, after you made me lose two of them. Oh, he lost both his, both his pinkies. Oof. Just give me the knife already, Captain! It's natural that society wants to avoid seeing its own underbelly. But luckily for those who refuse to look, I've taken many risks to protect them from the Komi Jewel. I've protected them from the Chinese faction as well. Yeah, I don't know everything about it, but I figured it was the Seiryu clan keeping it all balanced. The... balance is starting to crumble. It must be said that in any faction, the men operate businesses unknown to the boss. But I'm hearing that some have gone so low as to extort money from the homeless. Yeah, that's the Yokohama Leomon. I got plenty of personal experience with that. I see. And as for Totsuka, I never thought he would keep such a large business secret. Thank you for telling me. I knew of its existence, of course. And I was glad Totsuka was the director. Our clan bought that building 30 years ago. It was crumbling. Some wanted it demolished. Others wanted to make it a historic landmark. I settled the issue. I said it should be turned into a retirement home, run by Totska. I trusted him completely. I never knew he was running another type of business on the top floor. It was still in the exploratory phase. I... I was gonna tell you about it once it became a viable business. It's gross that you're even calling it a business. Chairman, the whole operation is just wrong. 
You gotta do something. The people there need to be let out. Hmm. Kasuga, was it? Yes, sir. I think you have the wrong idea here. Sorry? I appreciate you telling me about Totsuka's secret business. But I have no need or desire for your opinion. What? He's murdering innocent people. Misfortune is often a side effect of profit. One's happiness might be purchased with another's unhappiness. To a certain extent, that is unavoidable in our line of work. <laughs> Agreed, boss. With that logic, you could justify anything, no matter how dishonorable. Totsuka, I'd like to hear your own description of what happens on the top floor. The excellent course offers a smooth and painless transition out of this life. It's compassionate euthanasia. Euthanasia? That's bullshit! I saw it happen! You murdered the woman who was in a wheelchair! Euthanasia is a painless release given to those who need it. That woman in the wheelchair left this world peacefully. You should realize, sometimes it's not the patient who wants it, but the family. Oh yeah? What about Nanoha's dad? Perfect example. She wanted us to dispatch her father. Liar! What do you know about it? I met with her myself and she approved it. That can't be true. <laughs> Consider this your lesson about certain realities in this world. Anyway, I'm done playing teacher. Totska! Sir! Put it down. I don't need your finger. Thank you, Chairman. But that doesn't mean that I approve of this little side business you were running. Therefore... Takabe! Understood. Boys, take him out of here. What? Show him what'll happen if he ever sets foot in here again. Oh, exiled. <laughs> oh, no. Chairman! Chairman! Kasuga. A Yakuza cannot be judged merely by society's standards of what is right and wrong. Our reputation is everything. But we cannot preserve our reputation if we allow civilians like you to trespass. Don't fool yourself into thinking you did something brave today. The truth is, your actions have disgraced me and the Seiryu clan. I want that knowledge to weigh heavy on your heart. As scared as I should be right now, I'm super into it, Chairman. That was awesome. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was starting to think that during the 18 years I spent in prison, the type of Yakuza I admired went extinct. But you're one of them. You're the old-school kind of Yakuza. The kind I've always believed in, and always will. I see. I'm glad such a thing is still appreciated. I must admit, I find myself wondering what kind of Yakuza raised you like that. You're asking about my patriarch? Hmm. He was the type of guy who would show up to rescue a dumbass kid who dropped his name just to get out of trouble. Even a kid he never met. He cut off his own finger for the family name. Right. 
Let's go home. Wait. I'm curious. What was the name of this patriarch? Masumi Arakawa of the Arakawa family. Ex Tojo clan. Arakawa. Yep. Although when I went to find him the other day, he did put a bullet in me. <laughs> so, I guess I should probably take the hint. But he can't take away all the lessons I learned from him. To me, he's still the way a man ought to be. Arakawa. I'll remember that. Guess we should head back to the soap land. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Whatever. So, that was a shocker. How Nanoha agreed to the euthanasia? I guess you never know for sure what people really want. <sighs> hey, just a minute, please. Need something, Captain? Come to Sunlight Castle with me. I'm having Nanoha meet us there. What? Why? Just do it. Part of me thinks she misunderstood what they meant by treatment. But, who knows. Oh, I'm stretching. It feels nice. <sighs> hey there, Nanoa. Are you Nanoha Mukoda? Yes. We talked on the phone. I'm Takabe, the general manager. Um, where's Totsuka-san? He had some urgent business and couldn't be here, so I'm filling in. I see. I apologize for how sudden this is, but we're closing our institution. You're closing? Yes. As such, we won't be able to continue caring for your father. We're terribly sorry, but you'll have to make other arrangements for him. But the... the operation wasn't that scheduled for today? It's been cancelled. We deeply apologize and ask for your understanding. Cancelled? But if he doesn't get that operation, he'll die! Oh, yeah. Huh? Hold up. What did you just say? They said... he'll die without the surgery. Oh, ho, 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 dear. Uh, yeah, they were just lying. Just double-checking. But is that what you paid Totska for last time you met? What did you two talk about? Um, at the meeting, we... Oh, so they got their wires crossed. He thought, oh, I want you to get you rid of my Somehow father. And she's like, save him, please. Yen. But can I finish paying later? Maybe we don't even have to do the surgery that soon. I'm worried he's still too weak for it. Don't tell me you're having second thoughts now. Your father deserves to be at peace. You said it yourself. But now you're cheaping out on him? No, please don't say that. Of course I want Dad to have peace in his golden years. I don't want him in pain. But does it have to be so expensive? I'm afraid it does. Given the delicate nature of the task, there may be complications. Don't you see the need for finesse? That's what you're paying us for. Oh, okay. It's just my father's never had an operation. Oh. <laughs> First timer, huh? Hey, if we can laugh about it, it must not be that bad, right? Huh? Uh, I guess. Oh, yeah. They both thought each other were talking about something completely different. <laughs> so she had no idea. Yeah, no. It seems not. She thought the operation was a life-saving procedure. Damn. We barely got to him in time. Nanoha-san, 
Let me assure you, the operation is no longer necessary. Sorry? Your father was examined again, and doctors concluded the previous diagnosis was incorrect. Really? Yes. Therefore, we are returning this payment to you immediately. We realize how inconvenient our closure is to you. So, all money paid towards care after today's... Oh, god darn it. I have to wiggle the joysticks Days more. will be refunded. But... What do I do now? When does he have to move out? Please, don't worry. There will be no forced relocations. As I said, we realize how inconvenient this is for you. Your father may stay here free of charge until you make other arrangements. Are you serious? Finally, some actual fairness. This was by order of the chairman. I'm glad to hear that. Real glad. So, who was it who said she was in trouble again? Leave it alone. Everybody makes mistakes. Yeah, <laughs> so much for detectives, hunches. Yeah. Hey, Adachi's mistake led to her dad's survival, so there. Let's just be grateful for our luck. I'll trust you all to iron out whatever you need to. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> hey, bit of advice. You should put that away. Oh, yes, of course. Now that you've got a fat wad of cash, maybe you can afford to work at a nicer place, you know? Sorry? We were hired to work at Otohime Land while you were out. You were only working there so you could fund your dad's care, right? Uh, yes. You don't even have to go back. We'll tell the boss you quit if you like. Oh, and we'll get you any back pay you're owed. Really? Oh, that'd be great, actually. No worries. Go on and see your dad. I'm sure he's gonna flip when he sees you. Thank you. You know, seeing that smile, I can see why she was their most popular girl. <laughs> Such a ladies' man, aren't you? Okay. Let's go report to the boss. This ended up being a happy story, at least. Alright. He is... there. Okay. Question is... Should I...? Yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna not finish this yet. I think I'm near the end of the chapter, so I might as well continue. But, I shall give you... something that uh, I usually don't do, but I will now. A fair warning. Uh, if you're uncomfortable in certain scenes, you might wanna not watch. Hey boss, we're back. It got pretty crazy back there, but you know what? That's the end of the chapter, which is all the time I have for, actually. So, I'm going to call it there. So, that ended like a happy, all-put-together story for her. Then the boss died. And right now they're assuming he hung himself. But we'll have to figure more stuff out next time. But until then, I'll see you next time. Bye.